Hello, welcome to Math Focus. How to solve for a and b from this given equation 2 raised to power a multiplied by 3 raised to power b is equal to 12. 2 raised to power b multiplied by 3 raised to power a is equal to 18. Solution. Two raised to power a multiplied by three raised to power b is equal to twelve. Equation one. Two raised to power b multiplied by three raised to power a is equal to eighteen. Let's call this equation two. Multiply equation one by two. Two raised to power a multiplied by 2 raised to power b multiplied by 3 raised to power b multiplied by 3 raised to power a is equal to 12 multiplied by 18. Take note of this exponential rule that if you have a raised to power n multiply by a raised to power m this is equal to a raised to power n plus m now 2 raised to power a plus b multiply by 2 raised to power this b plus a is equal to 12 multiplied by 18. 3 raised to power b plus a is the same thing as a plus b. So we have 2 raised to power a plus b multiplied by 3 raised to power a plus b is equal to 12 multiplied by 18. Now remember this that if you have a raised to power n multiplied by b raised to power n this is equal to a b multiplied by a b raised to power of n and we can see we have the same power this is 2 multiplied by 3 raised to power of a plus b is equal to 12 multiplied by 18. Now let's see. 2 times 3. 6 raised to power a plus b is equal to. Now 12 can be written as 6 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 18 is 6 multiplied by 3. Let's perform a trick here. 6 raised to power a plus b is equal to this is 6 times 6 then multiply by 2 times 3 that is 6 multiply by 6 multiply by 6 this is equal to 6 raised to power 3 6 raised to power a plus b is equal to 6 raised to power of 3 they have the same base 6 therefore a plus b is equal to 3. Let's call this equation 3. Also, let's divide equation 1 by 2. Equation 1 is 2 raised to power a multiplied by 3 raised to power b then divided by 2 raised to power b multiplied by 3 raised to power a is equal to 12 over 18. Now let's see from here 6 here 2, 6 here 3. 2 raised to power a multiplied by 3 raised to power b over 2 raised to power b multiplied by 3 raised to power a is equal to 2 over 3. Now let's split this. 2 raised to power a over 2 raised to power b 
multiplied by 3 raised to the power b over 3 raised to the power a is equal to 2 over 3. Now from here, take note of this that if you have s raised to power n over s raised to power m, this is equal to s raised to power n minus m. And this can be written as 2 raised to power a minus b multiplied by 3 raised to power b minus a is equal to 2 over 3. Now let's see. In order to rewrite this, we have 2 raised to power a minus b multiplied by 3 raised to power minus bracket a minus b is equal to 2 over 3. Then this is 2 raised to the power a minus b multiplied by 1 over 3 raised to the power a minus b is equal to 2 over 3. Now let's see this is 2 raised to the power a minus b over 3 raised to the power a minus b is equal to 2 over 3. Now take note of this that a raised to the power n over b raised to the power n is equal to a over b to the power of n. So from here we have 2 over 3 raised to the power a minus b is equal to 2 over 3 raised to the power 1. But they have the same base as where a minus b is equal to 1. Let's call this equation 4. Now we can solve equation 3 and 4 simultaneously. Equation 3 is a plus b is equal to 3 and equation 4 is a minus b is equal to 1. Let's add the two equations together. This will cancel this. Now a plus a, 2a is equal to 3 plus 1, 4. A is equal to 2 here, 1, 2 here, 2, 2. That is the value of A. Now let's substitute for A in any of these equations, either equation 3 or equation 4. So let's use equation 4. From equation 4, A minus B is equal to 1, A is equal to 2, and 2 minus B is equal to 1. Now, minus B is equal to 1 minus 2. Let's see, minus B is equal to minus 1. B is equal to 1. This is the value of B.